the question of today's generation is whether to do btech in aiml or btech in electronic what's the difference who should choose what and can electronic students jump into aiml and vice versa and most importantly where is the money let's decode all of that in this video BTEC in AIML focuses on machine learning, deep learning, data science, Python programming, algorithms, a bit of maths overdose. Linear algebra side se high bol rahi hai. Ye information aap kisi bhi college ke AIML coursework se extract kar sakte hain. For example, bits AI and ML BTEC coursework visible onto your screen. BTEC in electronics focuses on circuits, semiconductors, communication, control systems, microprocessors, VLSI, embedded systems, more hardware and signal theory. In short, AIML, software plus algorithms. Electronics, hardware plus circuits and plus software. Yeah, electronics do require a decent programming knowledge. However, both AI and electronics are grounded in maths and logic. So don't expect to escape math either way. Can electronic students learn AIML? Yes, absolutely. If you are from ECE or EE, you already have the brain power to handle the core logic and relevant math. You just need to learn Python, take up ML and AI courses like NPTEL, Coursera, YouTube, build some projects, for example, image classification, IoT plus ML combo, like some projects which have required the basics from IoT and ML both. AI plus IoT or AI plus embedded is a deadly combo, very much in demand. So don't worry, you are not locked for AI or ML roles. In fact, many of the electronics engineers are working in AI or ML roles. Now let's shift to core electronic careers. If you love hardware, here is where you can sign. Design verification engineer like me, embedded systems developer, PCB designer, VLSI front-end, back-end, control and automation engineer and core PSU jobs like Dell, ISRO, DRDO, etc. Industries ki baat karun to semiconductors mein aapko Intel, Qualcomm, AMD, Nvidia, TSMC and many more companies. Consumer electronics mein aapko LG, Samsung wagera bhi mil jayengi. Halaki LG or Samsung wagera semiconductors mein bhi hai. And third option is automotive like EVs. Companies look for strong fundamentals and some hands-on tools like MATLAB, Verilog, Simulant, etc. Depending on the whole domain you have chosen of electronics. AI and ML job roles. This field is booming. If you go down the AI or ML route, here are these some jobs. Data scientist, machine learning engineer, AI researcher, NLP engineer, ML ops engineer, computer vision specialist. Skills ki baat karein to Python, NumPy, Pandas, TensorFlow, PyTorch, SQL, Cloud Tools, lots of project work. So these jobs are more software oriented and some of them pay very, very well, especially in product based companies or startups. But there is a catch. You need to show projects, Kaggle work plus GitHub, degrees alone don't cut it anymore we explored electronics we explored ai we have seen the roles from both sides now which one is better this is where people expect me to say one is better but it depends choose ai or ml if you enjoy coding math data you want fast-paced career growth you are okay with sitting in front of laptop for hours choose electronics if you enjoy building real stuff like whether you write the code or work on the hardware team, eventually that part will be going for building the hardware. So you enjoy building real stuff, you are into core concepts of circuits and devices, you want to explore PSUs or the high-end complex tech roles. Okay, so in those cases, you need to choose electronics. The best thing in 2025 is you don't have to stick to one. You can be an electronics engineer building AI-powered embedded systems or an AI engineer working on cutting-edge devices. So whether you are choosing AI, ML or electronics, remember, do not chase the trend. Chase your interest and skills. And if you are in electronics, don't feel left out. You can always switch to AI or ML. Drop a comment which side are you on? Team circuits or team code? And if you want a full roadmap for electronics or AI ML careers, let me know. I will make that too.